taking off from Japan under the cover of darkness. A gentle start to an epic solar-powered journey across the Pacific Ocean. And there's no going back. These latest pictures show Solar Impulse is well into its flight. If anything goes wrong now, the Swiss pilot, André Borschberg, would have to bail out into the ocean. Yeah, it's the point of non-return, not only for Solar Impulse as a flight and an aeroplane, it's for the project. Now the airplane ends up in the water and Audrey on the life raft and we're done. Or Audrey reaches Hawaii, it will be a triumph. Getting to this stage hasn't been easy. Bad weather's caused two months of delays and forced the first attempted crossing to be aborted. But no one's ever tried anything like this before. The experimental plane's vast wings are packed with 17,000 solar cells. It flies without a drop of fuel. And it's a test of endurance as well as technology. It will take the pilot five days and five nights to reach Hawaii. Strapped into his seat for the duration, he's allowed to sleep for just 20 minutes at a time. But if he succeeds, this will be the furthest a solar plane has ever flown, as well as the longest lasting solo flight in aviation history. Rebecca Morell, BBC News.